Hello, welcome to the video on learning about what's new in CCH Pro System FX Practice Management on the 2015.15.03 release. In this video, we will discuss several user requested enhancements to the billing module of the program. We have added the ability to transfer progress amounts from one engagement to another and the ability to apply progress across multiple engagements in billing. There are now 10 more customizable invoice statuses and 4 commonly requested columns to the client list in billing. We have also added an indicator to the billing notes button to show that a billing note has been added to the client, as well as the ability to see notes for all engagements of the client. The continue button, on the billing recap screens, now show the name of the window that you will be taken to. The option to transfer progress from engagement to engagement can be executed from administration, or while billing a client. In order to transfer progress, you must first allow the user the rights within the program. There is a separate security setting for accessing the process in administration versus accessing the process while billing the client. In administration, you must have the administrative privilege labeled transfer progress amounts from one engagement to another. In billing. The security privilege has the same label as it did for the administrative privilege. You must have the billing and invoicing privilege labeled transfer progress amounts from one engagement to another. In administration, the option to transfer progress is under the corrections area and is called transfer progress. The transfer date defaults to the current system date. The transfer from list contains all clients with multiple engagements. The transfer to list lists engagements related to the client selected in the transfer from list. When entering the amount of progress you wish to transfer, the amount cannot exceed the amount of progress available on the transfer from engagement. You can also enter a memo for the transaction, which will print on the transfer register. At the bottom of the window, the print transfer button will print the transfer register and post transfer will finalize the transfer process and update the system. When billing a client, the option is accessed by clicking on the Correct With button and selecting Transfer Progress Amounts. The process is the same as when accessing the option from administration, except the transfer from dropdown defaults to the client you are billing. A new report has been added to the Clients tab in the Reports module to help you track your progress transfers. In order to apply progress when billing multiple engagements together, you must first give the user the billing and invoicing privilege allowed distributing progress amounts for multiple engagements. When billing multiple engagements, and at least one engagement has available progress, you will see a slightly different adjust selected items screen. The upper portion of the screen will look and operate the same as before, but you will now see a section showing the engagements involved in the billing and their available progress amounts. If you need to transfer progress it must be done prior to entering this screen. Click Distribute Progress to apply available progress amounts. The Distribute screen shows the invoice amount, available progress and total progress for each engagement involved in the billing. To apply the progress, select the engagement and enter the amount of progress to apply, then click Apply. If you wish to apply the entire available amount for an engagement, just double-click the engagement. The applied amount and remaining progress amounts for each engagement applied will appear in the bottom section of the Distribute Progress screen. If you make an error, you can start over by double-clicking the item in the bottom section to remove the applied progress and move it back to the top. When finished, click OK. You will be taken back to the Adjust Selected Items screen to review the build amount and the total applied progress amount. When finished, click OK and generate your invoice. Ten new customizable invoice statuses have been added for better tracking of your billing process. Customize your invoice statuses in the Firm Setup area, on the Status Description tab. Enter the long description and short description for the statuses you wish to add. Give your users the rights to use the statuses by adding the Invoice Review Status Change privilege for the appropriate statuses. The Client Notes caption will now be in red text and italicized when the client has billing notes within the last 12 months. Additionally, there is a new checkbox to include notes for all engagements of the selected client. 
the Continue button on the Billing Recap screen will indicate where the button will take you when clicked, and will be different depending on how you access the screen. If you click on the Billing Recap button from the Select Whip screen, the button will take you back to the Select Whip screen. If you clicked on Generate Invoice, the button will take you to the Edit Invoice screen. This Billing Recap screen will only appear if you have the checkbox selected to display Billing Recap screen when generating invoice. If you click Close from the Select Whip screen, with Whip selected for billing, the button will take you back to the billing client list. This Billing Recap screen will only appear if you have the checkbox selected to display Billing Recap screen when generating invoices. Thank you for watching the video on the enhancements that have been made to the billing module in CCH Pro System FX Practice Management on version 2015.15.03. For more information, please visit our website at support.cch.com and search our knowledge base for more information. Again, thank you for watching.